हेलो फ्रेंड्स आई एम मुस्कान आई होप यू ऑल आर डूइंग वेल टुडे वी विल लर्न अबाउट फ्लैट लिस्ट आई विल बी एक्सप्लेनिंग फ्लैट लिस्ट इन द मोस्ट इजी वे दैट यू कैन अंडरस्टैंड इजीली सो व्हाट इज फ्लैट लिस्ट एंड व्हाई वी यूज फ्लैट लिस्ट इन रिएक्ट नेटिव फ्लैट लिस्ट कॉम्पोनेंट इज एन इनबिल्ट रिएक्ट नेटिव कॉम्पोनेंट दैट डिस्प्लेज द सिमिलर स्ट्रक्चर डेटा इन अ स्क्रोलेबल लिस्ट लाइक इफ यू वॉन्ट टू शो सिमिलर टाइप ऑफ डेटा लिस्ट सो वी कैन यूज फ्लैट लिस्ट फॉर दैट it works well for large list of data where the number of list item might change over time is opposed to the scroll view the flat list renders only those elements that are currently being displayed on the screen so if you are using scroll view scroll view initially renders all elements which uh, we have in the list but flat list only renders those element which displayed on the screen thus it does not have any impact on the performance of the application so it is preferable to use flat list component to display a large list of data so let's understand this with code uh, let me zoom it so for flat list um, uh, i have created uh, one file name flatlist example.js and uh, uh, first i am going to import flat list from react native and then we will use flat list here in the return method and um, uh, first we have to pass data in flat list uh, it will be an array of object so first let me create an array here named car brands so in car brands um, i will put an object uh, and in this object i will uh, put id name price of the car uh, i will duplicate this object and create a list of array and i already change values of um, uh, other object so you can see here i have a list of uh, object in this array now i am going to use this car brand in this data flat list supporting the most handy features like um, fully cross platform optional horizontal mode pull to refresh scroll loading scroll to index support uh, multiple column support like you want to um, show in a column so it will uh, take num column as a prop and we can um, give value in a numeric form like 2 or 3 or 4 and so on by passing extra data to flat list we make sure flat list itself will re-render when the state change without setting this prop flat list would not know it needs to re-render any time because it's a uh, it's a pure component and the prop comparison will not show any changes we will have a um, key st extractor prop in a uh, flat list uh, which tells the list to use the ids for the react keys instead of the default key property we have a required property in flat list which is render item so um, i will add render item in it render item takes a function uh, and this function takes an item so in render item we have to pass a function let's create this function and uh, it will return um, some jsx and uh, it takes an item from data and uh, render it into the list if i have to show name of the car so i have to use the key which is uh, mentioned in the list like i have mentioned name so i have to use name here with dot so let's save it and you can see here is the uh, list of item now i am going to uh, add some styles of this uh, flat list container so i will call it as a card container in card container i give background color so you can see background color is changed and it it is taking only this space of the screen uh, now i am going to style name of the cars yeah so it's visible clearly right um, so here you can see we have all the car brands which we add in the list like audi kia toyota now i am going to uh, add price here with its style below the name so here you can see price is also visible in the emulator so let's style this card container i give margin 20 so here you can see it displays as a list right here little padding from inner part of the card yeah so it's look uh, great now now i will give it flex direction row and justify space between so it will align in a row and uh, with justify space between it will align here you can see my last tutorial for uh, justify contained and for flex box and flex properties you can see link on the i button so uh, for flex box styling you can see uh, that video let's save it you can see it align in a row with justify contained space between now it's look uh, quite pretty now we will use key extractor in the flat list 
की एक्सट्रेक्टर यूज टू एक्सट्रैक्ट अ यूनिक की फॉर अ गिवन आइटम एट स्पेसिफाई इंडेक्स की इज यूज फॉर कैशिंग एंड एज द रिएक्ट की टू ट्रैक आइटम री ऑर्डरिंग यू कैन सी अ स्क्रॉल इंडिकेटर हियर सो इफ यू वॉन्ट टू हाइड इट यू कैन यूज शो वर्टिकल स्क्रॉल इंडिकेटर फॉल्स सो इट विल हाइड नाउ यू कैन सी वेन आई एम स्क्रॉलिंग इट इज नॉट विजिबल हियर एंड वी कैन ऑल्सो अलाइन इट हॉरिजोंटली सो फॉर दिस वी हैव टू गिव हॉरिजोंटल ट्रू हियर Yeah, so here you can see it is in horizontal manner right now, and we can scroll horizontally. We have to change some styling for horizontal view, but yeah, you can um, use horizontal prop as well. And uh, we have num column options. so here we can put uh, like a number of columns we want to show here, but it it will only work with horizontal false or you can say vertical true it is visible here with uh, two columns but it is um, out of uh, the screen right now so i will um, reduce some margin from here okay so you can see it is in a um, column right now which is divided in two so that's all there is to flat list thanks for watching if you like my work please do like share and subscribe